Hello everybody, this is Telepanda once again. Uh, I hope all of you are having a great day. And once again, I am alone. Uh, two more days of being alone and then we will have our good friend Jedi back. So let's get off to the amusement park. But first we're going to do one shout out. We're going to do a shout out to PM Palmer. Uh, he's a subscriber in my on my channel. He does have his channel, his own channel. Uh, pretty much, he's putting trailers of incoming games. Uh, so do go check it out. Uh, there's some interesting games there that, uh, if you have not seen the trailer, uh, he maybe had. Well, he has a few of them. So do go check him out. And welcome to my path of VIP, PM Palmer. Okay, so what we're gonna do today, as you can see in my inventory. I might do a little redstone. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna attempt it with what Jedi taught me. Uh, let's see how it goes. Uh, so pretty much if you saw my previous episode, I built a piranha. Oops, sorry. A piranha. And what I did is I built two other ones. I was not able to figure out a way to put it a water slide. A water slide will be coming into my uh, panda land. Uh, if you don't know what a panda land is, it's my amusement park. But it will not be the piranhas. Uh, what I'm going to do the piranhas for is I'm going to make it as a dunk tank. Uh, so pretty much once you get dunked, you don't, you don't get dunked. You get eaten by the piranha. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, so the redstone and the sticky piston is pretty much to have the teeth of the piranha open when you hit the target. So it's, it's pretty much going to be a bone arrow trying to hit a button in a distance once you hit that button it will open the teeth and the person will fall inside so we'll see what we'll see what we can do here we'll see how it goes uh, I'm alone so we won't be able to test it out perfectly but this weekend we're gonna have fun with the roller coaster with the dunk tank and if I build something else tomorrow we will build that too and talking about that um, what I'm going to start doing is I will not do a video on my Let's Play every day from now on. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna post in the description the days that the Let's Play is going to come out. I am going to do a Minecraft video per day. It just It's going to vary between my Let's Play, my Sky Island Challenge, and probably come out with something else. But the Let's Play is going to be three to four days a week. My Sky Island is going to be two days a week, and I'm going to try to find something else to uh, to put in. So it is, is going to be a Let's Play per, per day, uh, a Minecraft video per day. It's just, I don't know which day yet. I will put it in the description once I'm done uh, finishing this video here. So as you see, there's three piranhas. There's the original one. And I built two other ones here. So there is going to be a path that leads to this place. To this little dock here. So this is going to be the entrance. Uh, I forgot to do some ladders. Uh, but just real quick. Let's put that down right here. I think I have a lot of crafting tables already. But we are going to be using them. Okay. So let's move this out of the way. Nope. Not that. Okay, so this is going to be the entrance for the shooter, the bow shooter. So the bow shooter is going to shoot a target in the distance over there. We're going to make the pillar, and there's going to be a target with a button. Once you have a, what we'll say is you have three shots to hit that button. If that button gets hit, the person will be standing here, will get eaten by that piranha. Uh, let's go down the ladder. Seems a little safer. So again, I'm not done make planning it all there, but they're going to pretty much just fall in here. There's going to be water in here so you don't get hurt. Off video, I did do a path for the redstone. So we're going to have to uh, hope it works. <laughs> because I'm not the greatest with redstone, but we'll see how it goes. So first of all, let's go do our target. So we're going to swim in the distance. 
Let's swim very slowly. So as you see under underground, I do have my path of red for the redstone that will lead all the way to there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start putting the redstone just because I need the redstone to be um to be not lit at the bottom. So this little part here cannot be lit. Actually, let's put a, a repeater because I'm going to be going high up. So what we're going to do is do that. 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 So again, I'm doing what I learned from Jedi. So this has to be off. Okay, so redstone here. Let's. Okay, I'm gonna put a block here for now, but oh, I am gonna remove it. I just did it again. Okay. Let's crouch. Let's remove that. Oh, I could always put that redstone back. No problem. That block here. Okay, let's put the redstone back. There's going to be a redstone here. And a torch here. So this is how it should be. So we need to go up and have it continuing this pattern. So the next one, we're going to... This is just to bring the signal down. Uh, let's keep going with the little space here okay so there you go too high so you leave a gap you put a torch so you see this is opposite now of what I want so I at least need to go higher oh let's get some more wood Okay, so let's go here. Okay, so this is what I want. But I do want to go a little higher. So the target is there. Uh, the uh, piranhas are over there. So I'm going to need to go at least another four high. So this is another two. So let's put this here this here and this here so as I tell you Jedi is a really good redstone teacher uh, if you guys want to see more redstone stuff with him leave comments that might be the extra episode him showing us red redstone okay like that and that's gonna make it so it's like we want it so the piranhas are there. So if if I had a button, let's craft another crafting table. Because I forgot to make the button. We'll make a wooden button. Let's break this crafting table. Uh, we're already crouching. Yeah, it works. Okay, and once an arrow hits it, it's going to stay that way. So what we're going to do is... Actually, what we're going to do is go another four high. I don't feel it's high enough, and I lost that button. It's okay, I'll just craft another one after. So uh, we'll go another... For high. Like that. Okay. That. 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 I just hope it's gonna. 
it's gonna go all the way down I'm not sure if I'm too high if I'm too high I'm gonna need to find a place to put a repeater in the middle of this I think I should be okay with all the uh, torches okay so piranha so what we're gonna do here I think I have my axe yet. Yeah. There we go. Gonna make it a lot easier. Okay, I have my white wool and my red wool. So, just to better and identify where the button is, it's gonna be in the middle of the red wool. Let's just put that down, craft another button because my button fell. There we go. So that should be like that. Okay, so let's just finish this one row just to make it look nice. And let's just cover it up. Okay. Geronimo! Okay, so we're going to have to start by... We are, we're going to have to go inside over there because I don't want to put a hole. Because if I put a hole, there's water that's going to go all inside. And what we're going to do is we're going to work through the night since it's light enough in there. Okay, so let's go here. Let's go over here. Okay, I did say it was supposed to be off. Yes, off. Okay, so I know you can go 15, I believe, but I'll go 14 just in case. 1, 2, 3. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And I need a repeater. So you always put it in the direction that the, like, you're pressing the button. The repeater has to go in the direction of where you want things to happen. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I'll leave it at thirteen because we're gonna be turning a corner here. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Let's just put it like that. Okay, I wonder if this is gonna work. Okay, I'm gonna give it a test, just in case. Okay, I'm gonna put that there temporarily. Okay, it might, I'm missing some redstone. Well, that's okay. What I could do. Put another repeater. And I have that extra redstone here. I might need more. I think I'm going to need three more redstone. So what I'm going to do. I am going to go get three more by putting repeaters instead. So, one, two, three. And I have three repeaters, that's perfect, that's all I needed. Okay, so it's my bad, I didn't bring enough materials. 
Oh, this. Oh, I am gonna be missing some repeaters now. Oh, uh, I guess we'll use our axe. Okay, so yeah. Okay, is this gonna work? Uh, let me see here. Okay, to bring it up, I'm just, uh, I'm going through a Jedi's lesson here. Oh, uh, auto save. I do apologize about that. Okay, so Jedi's lesson is no. Am I going to need to go one further? Put a redstone here and the torch there. No. Okay, so what I did is I went off camera, I tried a few things, and I found the best way of doing it. And at the same time, I went to go get more redstone just to finish this. Uh, so pretty much what we're going to do is we're just going to make our way up. It was, it seemed like it worked the best way. There's probably a more efficient way, but like, oh, I did put some redstone there, but I forgot to remove it. So I put one here and one here. And pretty much what we're going to do is, so let's put this here. We're going to bring them all up here. And repeater, repeater, repeater. Okay, so I need to get out of here. Uh, let's cover this first. Uh, need to make it look like the fish. This, this piranha looks a little different, if you didn't see the difference. <laughs> okay, and there, there, there. Right. At least the redstone's hidden. So what we're going to do is we're going to go through the mouth. Whee! And there we go. Put this here. Okay, so now what we need to try to do is we need to. I should have put that first. The sticky pistons. I think I could put it. No. Um, let's see here. If I put this another block here. 
just to walk around. Can I put it here? Is it gonna... Let's grab the teeth. And... Aha! Got it. We're gonna put the white wool afterwards. It's two. Three. Okay, let's go get our white wool. Like that. So technically, it needed to stay on. So that's why I was doing the whole thing. So what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to go over there and either bring it down one or bring it up one. Because the door, uh, the trap should be closed. So that when you hit the button, it opens it. So we're going to go quickly over there. Let's see what we can do. So as you see, it's not an easy target. I might decorate this uh, button a bit more. But this is just temporary. Okay, what I might do is, uh, is go up another. There we go. And let's just nerd pull up. Okay, so let's do this. Okay, so I said I need to go up one. So here, so this is going to make it look a little weird though. If I put, oh, am I going to lose that button too? Yeah. If I put the button, oh, I'm going to need this. Oh, I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna need this. And the third button. Okay, let's give it a test here. So if I put a button here. No, that doesn't work. Um, so I'm gonna need to. What I could do is I could always leave it like this. Makes a little design at the same time. But that should make it go. Yeah. Okay. So, technically the trap door should be closed right now. Oh, um... I need to put the white wool on top. Okay, so that needs to go there. So, what I can do is Actually, let's just make sure it works and I will go with the detail of video so just again real quick yeah it does work let's go over there to make sure our trap door is closed parkour way up <laughs> no. that's another thing I'm not good with is parkours <laughs> Okay, please be closed. Please be closed. There you go. It's closed. Okay, so let's do this real quick. I have my bow. Let's see if I can hit that button. Okay. 
I say about here. Nope. Uh, I know it's feasible. This is not an easy one. I'm just going to keep shooting. Hopefully I get it in one of these. I just hope it works. Oh, oh, I heard it. I heard it. Look at that. I got it. So it does work. It does work. So technically we just have to remain closer to it. So yeah, it does work. It does open it. So the person standing here well, it would have got dunked down into the mouth. So, there you go. And that's how it's done. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, make sure to leave any suggestions on if you want me to build anything. Uh, I'm up for suggestions. I'm ready to build anything. And hope you enjoyed this. So, remember, this weekend, we're going to have fun with this and try to dunk someone. But I'm going to... I'm gonna, Modify a few things, put water in here so we don't get hurt when we fall. Modify the tower over there so it looks a little prettier. Uh, the tower over here. And so yeah, subscribe to my, video, my channel if you enjoy watching me. And please leave a like. And have yourself a great day. Bye.